a great conflict once erupted on the outskirts of an unloving place. Johanna the Dark Mane, a skilled sorceress and archer, along with her lover the fierce Viking warrior Birger the Brave, both fought back the realm's hordes to a standstill. A truce was then born on the borders of Guiron village. This peace both sides respected, and neither civilization would tread past the realm's borders into conflict ever again. Both remained in the village as champion protectors, but after Johanna bore a child with Birger, the solitary Viking ventured away on a new path, leaving her to raise and train their daughter, Astrid, in ways of battle and survival. Things remained tranquil, at least for a while. Yet, one dark day scorned Johanna. Her ties with the village became severed, and she lost her ancient powers and the use of her legs. It left her a broken shell and a cursed outcast. Astrid, having grown into a strong young woman, was responsible for both of them now. With food scarce on this present day, Astrid set out for the woods, where she could use her skills as a huntress to good sport. She left her mother as always, dwelling in the days of old. Maybe later today, hope would finally pick her up. Just maybe. A misty morning dawned, and the air was crisp and cool to the skin. Autumn was just around the corner and the leaves would start to turn soon, heralding the beginning of the cold season. I've been in Jordanheim my whole life. Wait, did you say your name was too... I'm pretty sure... Ah, the salvia plant. 
This can be used to make potions. Is that Axel? What a coward! Throws a rock and runs away. I'm going to chase him down. The Elmard River runs through most of the Shroud in Sveria and the outlying forest areas. It is a source of clean water to many villages and towns across northern Sveria.
The village of Guilon was founded by Birger and Johanna after the Battle of Goblin's March, fought not far from here. A statue of Birger once stood in the center, but has been removed since the village fell out with Johanna. Right now. 